it frees me from things. I, I put a lot of my, my, my writing is about my experiences and I don't want people to recognize me on the street and know all that about, I mean, you know, if they, if they read my book, they know a lot about me. Mm -hmm. um, so that's uh, which is like fear. And, I mean, so but you, but, but you, you, you become sort of... But it does help me function free. Yeah, no, I think it, I think it is kind of like that. I, I suppose people never fully arrive, you know, we never feel like we're, we fully arrived, but mm. in some senses, in some senses, you have made um, an arrival, you know. Mm -hmm. it's funny that Does that give you some... I feel really blessed. I feel really blessed. Is the blessing an inspiration, or is, or yeah. is, or is only pain an inspiration? Do you see what I'm getting at? See what I'm saying? JT? Yes. What are you hoping for? I want a, I want a room of one's own. Halloween. What did what did you do? I just had a cake for me. Yeah. <laughs> I dressed up. Oh, cause it's your birthday, right? Mine's on the twenty eighth of October. Yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah. Jean Arlo. Oh. I had a birthday. I took photos for you. You did. Yeah. Where'd you go? I'll take you the photo. I'll bring it. Yeah. So it's not like anybody really watched us. We just kind of, you know, there's lots of stuff to get into at a truck stop. Is this sex that you had because somebody was forcing themselves on you or because you wanted to have it? Well, originally I, it was forced, but it, it became something that um, I couldn't really tell the difference between what I wanted and what was offered, you know? Okay, they're going to they're gonna dress you. Check it out. I wonder what George is. I think you look great. Um, thank you. You do look great. What is this? Uh, this is Austria. one of your best yet, I think. In Italy? Yeah. That's right. I'm going to write about what wankers this whole group of people is. She's and you know how everybody it. just is really decadent, be decadent and terrible and, and, sick. <laughs> and, and obnoxious. What we do to tiny children. Exactly. And, and dogs, which are out on the lawn, which I suggest you film Except now since I have no makeup the on. The Jews. What are you guys looking for? Oh, the, the holy grail of jackets. I, I mean, I don't know if you like the one I have more or not, but... It was just black. I mean, it was kind of similar to what you had a minute ago. Yeah, but they... But it was, um... Did I bring it? Maybe I brought it up when I went up to check my hair. Let's go check. Let's go look up in the back. I mean, did somebody hang it back up? You guys looked at all these jackets? Yeah, we looked. Well, it was through. like, it wasn't really amazing. I mean, it was just kind of a plain <laughs> black jacket. It's not underneath this. My name is Azio Gento. I'm 27 years old. I'm from Rome, Italy. I was born September the 20th, 75. Um, I'm a Chihuahua breeder. Wow. I have 16 Chihuahuas. Wow. And uh, girls and, and boys. <laughs> it's true. Really? Yeah. Oh, really? I didn't know. If, uh, I was like, and you do interpretive true. dance. Remember John Belushi in that scene in Animal House when he just takes the guitar and smashes the. <laughs> smash. Why did she pass you off as her younger sister? Because it was less competitive to talk to men, to be having a boy around, and also, if we were two pretty girls out, we were more likely to get free things. Not me, I thought. 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 Not me
non mi odiare perché sono italiana. Don't hate me because I'm Italian. Don't hate me because I'm fat. How, how old were you when she started um, passing you off as her younger sister? Like about five or six. It wasn't a big deal. I mean, I wasn't quite, I just, I knew what the difference between a boy and a girl was. <laughs> but but JT's going to watch me because I'm such a lightweight, it's pathetic. You I'm know? really lightweight. I'm such a lightweight and I don't like feeling out of control like that.